Alright, sorry for the lack of videos for the past couple days. I decided to study my ass off so I wouldn't fail another test. And I succeeded. I got like a D or a C or something. I don't know. Anyways, this deck right here, it's gonna look really random considering it has Light Sworns, Fire Fists, and a couple of Bujin cards, Bujin Turtle. But I swear, it works and it's a lot of fun. Well, and Flake Spreader. I never actually got to use them, that was just something I was trying out. I'm not done with this deck. I'm still working on it, but I think I'm a little happy with how it is right now. Basically, all the deck revolves around is milling the crap out of it and bringing out this guy, Bujintai Kagutsuchi. Uh, this little guy right here requires two level 4 wa beast warrior type monsters. When he's summoned, you mill the top five cards from your deck, and if a Bujin monster would be destroyed, you can detach an XYZ material from this card instead. He's a 2500 beater, mills the top 5 cards from your deck, and can protect himself 2 times from destruction. And the whole deck revolves around bringing him out, basically. And then, yeah, using his effect to mill, there's just a whole bunch of cards that allow you to activate their effects when they're milled, like Zephros the Elite, you can return your Fire Fist cards to your hand and use them again. Uh, there's only one Fire Fist Buffalo, because he can send two Fire Fist monsters or cards from your side of the field or your hand to the graveyard to special summon himself from the grave, so it's pretty nice. And of course, just one Wolf Bark, one Fire Fist Bear, so that they can get each other out from the grave. I was trying out his Plague Spreader, like in my last one or two videos, but my last one or two builds. I never actually got to use him though, so I don't know if he's good or not. And of course, uh, two Light Sworn Archers, because he's a beast type, I mean beast warrior type, who can special summon himself when he's sent from the deck to the grave. Same thing with Light Sworn Beast, if these two cards get sent from the deck to the grave due to some awesome mill, you can use them to go into the Bujin Kajasuchi, Kagutsuchi, and yeah, leave him out. And then the turtles, there's only two turtles in this whole deck. Those are the only Bujin cards in the deck, and they're there solely to protect him from, like, uh, that one banishing trap card, because he doesn't protect himself from that. And basically, yeah, they're just there to get milled. And if they're in their hand, they're 1700 attack, and they're beasts, they're not really all that great. But since the main card I bring out with it gets brought out quite often and pretty much in every single duel, it's... I've never actually really used it. Skill Prisoner has been protecting him pretty well on its own. I could probably just remove it and be totally fine, because Skill Prisoner is really good. So you'll see. Thank <laughs> you. 